In this Excel video, I will show you how to add custom words to the Excel dictionary. Let's get started. So here I have a spreadsheet. It's an inventory for a hypothetical synth pop CD shop. And there are several bands here and also album titles that may not follow the typical spelling. So when I go up here to review spelling, Notice that it finds several spelling mistakes, even though they're not really spelling mistakes. This is actually how the album is supposed to be spelled. Of course, you could perform your spell check and then gradually add words to the dictionary. Often it's better just to add all of the non-standard words all at once to the spell check dictionary. This is how you would do it. Go to File, and down here to Options, choose Proofing, and click on Custom Dictionaries. And you could choose either of these custom dictionaries. I'll just select this one here and click Edit Word List. This brings up a dialog box that I can use to enter several words that may need to be on this list. So I'm going to start with Traveler, spelled differently than typical. I'll click Add. Now that word will be considered part of the dictionary. This band, Jelly Rocks, that will be flagged as a spelling error. So I'm going to add that in, Jelly Rocks. Tap enter on the keyboard. Now it's added to this custom dictionary in the Excel spell check dictionary. While I'm at it, I'm gonna add synth pop, best music ever. It's most often spelled with a hyphen between the synth and pop, but most of the biggest fans of this genre leave out the hyphen. So I'm gonna also leave it out here. Tap enter on the keyboard. It's now considered a correct spelling. So I could just continue adding words that are not standard but that are actually correct, at least in this spreadsheet. Notice that you can delete entries if you change your mind, or you could delete all, but I'm happy with this list. I'm gonna click OK, click OK again, and again, to get back to my spreadsheet. Now, I'm gonna do a spell check, so I'll go up to Review, Spelling. Looks like I forgot one, that should have been an obvious one. I'll just click Add to Dictionary, Add to Dictionary, but all of the words that I entered into the custom dictionary are now being considered to be legitimate words. Now it's important to be aware that the words that you add to this spell check custom dictionary will be considered legitimate words in all of the workbooks that you open on the computer that you're working on. And not only that, but they will also be considered to be legitimate in Microsoft Word and PowerPoint and any other Microsoft products that have spell check. In my opinion, that's a good thing, but you need to be aware of it. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you found it to be helpful. If you did, please like, follow, and subscribe. And when you do, click the bell and you'll be notified when I post another video. If you'd like to support my channel, consider clicking the thanks button below the video and supporting me through my Patreon account and by buying channel merch. And you'll see information about those options in the description below the video. Speaking of Patreon, I want to give a quick shout out to my $5 Patreon supporters. You're amazing. Thank you so much. I appreciate the support you give. You help make it possible for me to continue making these videos each and every week. 